It's now my singular honor and privilege to seek your permission to invite the General of Generals, Generalismo, son of the soil, pride of Africa, pride of Nigeria, pride of Taraba State, pride of the Jukunman, Jermai of Zazza, Jiji Karu, Abonta of Ukari, Bangaro of Donga, Barde Baba of Zazza, General Theophilus Yakubu Danjuma, to please come forward for the Remixia Remark Sir. Some few words ago, some few years ago, I warned that the armed forces are either not capable or unwilling to protect us and that we must defend ourselves. The first, the first denial of what I said came from the Ministry of Defense. They said I was lying. And they set up a kangaroo board of inquiry to investigate the truth or otherwise of what I spoke and they invited me to come and testify. I did not go. I did not go. They wrote their report which said that I was only speculating that there was no evidence. And now there is evidence. The whole country now is being run and overrun. And one very clear thing that is happening is that these foreign invaders they are not even Muslims. A lot of the casualties inflicted on the land are on Muslims. They are destroying even mosques. But they were allowed to come into the country by our government. Now, as a soldier, my training teaches me that the best defense is attack. Right now, right now, we are all sitting ducks. These people are armed to the teeth with all the weapons of mass destruction. And we don't have you. But we have the numbers. And the land belongs to us. They are trying to recolonize us and take over our land. Can I allow you to defend yourselves? Yeah, Your Majesty. You heard what they said. You must then 
unite our people. A lot of the attacks that I got was from our people. They said I, I told them to defend themselves. I didn't give them arms. I will not give you arms. Find out why, how these people who have it got it. Use the same means, use the same means to defend you, to defend yourselves. This beautiful land called Nigeria, the biggest country for black men in the whole world, is being brought to ruins by absolutely useless criminals. But how did they get here? How did they get here? Most of them are foreigners. Of course, we know there are collaborators among them. Some of them may be even here. So my prayer is that the God Almighty that has given us this land will give us the courage to face up to our enemy and locate where he is and root him out, drive him out of the country. This we must do. Otherwise, Nigeria is finished. Thank you.